Hey there, Trekker Tribe. I'm Trekker Wilson, your outdoorsy mom, inspiring you to discover you outside. So hopefully uh, we do a good job with the live feed. Um, so today we are on top of an Alp. So we're in the Swiss Alps and I had the opportunity to come up to the Alps today and I thought maybe I'd show you guys a little bit of the view of something that makes me super happy. So for those of you that care to hang around. I'll show you a little bit of the views that I'm seeing and may, hopefully we'll get a, a little treat that I'll show you that's down there a little bit. But let me just orient you. We're on something called the Fjord Alp and it's in the Ingeborg region of Switzerland. Um, so it's in, still in the German-speaking region of Switzerland. So it's really nice. Um, and let me just switch around here. This is my view for today and it makes me super super happy hi guys I see some people are watching if you have any questions I guess that's the point of this live I'll try to answer them but it's about midday here in Switzerland and it's a beautiful 20 degrees Celsius or um, what is that gosh 80 no 70 degrees Fahrenheit um, and so we're at 1800 meters or 600 feet above sea level and what I'm seeing is a bunch of peaks along this view here. And actually, I'm just having a look here. Uh, there's something happening down here. I don't know if you can see that. But about uh, 45 minutes ago, this helicopter landed. And now it's picking up a bunch of Swiss Army guys who were parachuting down. And they parachuted and landed right at this peak right here. So hopefully we'll get a nice treat and watch them take off. So stand by for that. In the meantime, I'll orient you a little bit more. So we're at 1850 meters, like I said, above sea level. There's a peak right there. It's called Titlis. Um, that's at, uh, I think that's 3200 meters. So about 10,000 feet above sea level. Um, so a little less than twice the height of what we're at now. But what you can see is just some gorgeous peaks. Some glaciers in the background that are quickly melting. You can see the runoff, but it makes for some beautiful waterfalls. I don't know if you listen closely, you can hear the waterfalls in the background. But the Swiss make their a lot of their mountains easily accessible to everyone. So if you can see over there, there's a restaurant and a waiting pool for everyone. Sorry, it's going out of focus. And then just past that restaurant, there's a gondola, so I took a seven-minute gondola ride up from the valley that's down in there where we parked the van, and then the valley, from the valley, the Seilbahn, or the uh, gondola, came up and dropped us off right here, and we've just been hanging out, listening to the sounds of the waterfall, and taking in the views. It's a beautiful day. I think these guys are going to take off soon. I'll maybe show you that. How long have we gone here? It doesn't tell me how long this video is. But I can go on and on. But they also have a nice little wading pool, like I said. They encourage you to, like, the kids especially to take their shoes off and uh, walk along the rocks that are in the in the pond. Okay, here we go. The helicopter is going to take off. I hope I can be filming this. Um, but we're going to do it anyway. I don't know if you can hear it. There we go. It's kind of exciting. I've been in a helicopter two times in my life and I loved it each time. So I have to do that more. But these guys, I didn't see them take off. So I, I don't know if they jumped from this particular helicopter or where they jumped from. But they definitely jumped not far from here and then parachuted down and landed up here. So here they go. Hi guys, I can see some people watching. I don't know what to do with these buttons. Thanks, Mike. It says I can wave at you or bring you on camera. I'm not gonna push any buttons. I'm just gonna video here. This is very exciting. I love watching helicopters take off, especially in Alpine and in the mountains. Something kind of cool about that. 
There were about 10 to 12 parachuters or paratroopers or whatever you call them. They're going to take off here. When they came in, they came in pretty smooth, but then they kind of big, did a quick cut this way, which was kind of cool. They banked a little bit to get in here. See if they'll do it again. I don't know if you can hear me. Can you guys hear me? Just let me know if I'm too quiet or too loud. The helicopter's quite loud. Doesn't say how long this video is. I don't want it to make it too long. Hopefully they take off soon. I can show you some other things in the meantime. A lot of these beautiful waterfalls, like I said. <clears throat> okay. I'll just show this a little bit. I'll just watch in the, from the side to see if any, see if it takes off. But you can see the waterfall coming through a little bit of the snow or glacier there. Oh, it's a really beautiful day. Okay, I think the last guy's getting on. Everyone's watching it. It's pretty cool. Maybe this is boring for you guys. <laughs> Sorry. You can get a lot closer. All clear. All clear for takeoff. Go for it. All right. Oh, this is exciting. All right, see if I can keep them in view. I lost them already. There they are. Ah, oh, they're just heading straight out that way. Oh, it's kind of hard to see. There they go. I don't know if they're going to go up and over or if they're going to take the valley path. They're going to do the valley path through there. You see them right there. Not a bad gig for a morning's work. There they go. So they go through the valley and that's the way the road goes. We take it... Uh, We'll take that road out. <clears throat> it's just below them. Just a couple more things I just wanted to show you guys. It's really beautiful here. So I'll just give you a quick panorama one more time. All these rugged peaks over here with the waterfalls. The high peak over there. The restaurant. The waiting pool. And if you hear, listen closely, you can hear a one of a, at least a couple of things. Maybe the waterfalls in the background. I don't know if you can hear that. But oftentimes you can hear some, let's see if we can see them over here. This is what I like about the Swiss Alps too. <laughs> here you can see one over there. I don't know if you can see it. There's one and here's a bunch. I don't know if you can hear the cowbells. <laughs> there they find a little bit. So anybody who needs more cowbell in their lives, there you go. There's this guy just sitting there. Anyway, so that's our day today. I thought I'd share a little bit. I hope you guys are all having a good day. Let me know if you enjoy these. I kind of think about doing these every once in a while, but I don't know if there's anybody really cares that much. But, but there we go. I'll switch it around and sign off. Thanks for watching, you guys. Take care. Enjoy your day. He's been sleeping for about an hour. He's doing really good. Okay, take care guys. Bye. Okay, I'm gonna... Oh, there it is. Finish. Where's the off button? Okay, bye. Subscribe to follow along. Hit that like button and share the fun. If you love a good scenic vlog, I hiked up a mountain in Switzerland just for you. Thanks for watching. I'm Trekker Wilson. Stay safe, stay curious, and I'll see you down the road.